Well, Richards is no longer Burlington's airport director. This after a nearly six hour long termination hearing that ended just before midnight. Local 22's Courtney Kramer was there. She joins us now in the newsroom with a recap. Courtney. Lauren, counselors deliberated for nearly two hours. Ali Jang was the sole counselor to vote in Jane Richards' favor. He was hoping to serve the airport until June of next year and walk away honorably from the role. The current situation is untenable to retain Mr. Richards as director of aviation. After a six hour hearing and a 10 to 1 vote, Gene Richards is out as airport director of Burlington International. During Thursday night's special termination hearing, the city attorney laid out a presentation alleging Richards barked orders at airport employees and often swore at them. Laying into employees or ripping them a new one when he disagrees or doesn't like something screaming at employees that they don't know what they're doing. According to findings in the independent report, Richards was using the airport's gas facility to fill up his personal car nearly 60 times. I am truly sorry for any offensive behavior. Uh, whatever happens this evening, please know that I have learned from my experience and I am disappointed in my actions that have cost, cast a negative spotlight on the airport. Mayor Murrow Weinberger asked Richards to step down last month. He says despite his successes and handling of the airport during the pandemic, Richards is no longer in a position to serve the airport's top role. The actions and repeated lapses in judgment documented in Anita Tinney's memo are inconsistent with the shared values of collaboration, belonging and respect that I expect our department heads to demonstrate. Both Richards and his attorney agree the odds were against them going into the hearing, but we're thankful for a chance to clear his name. Most important, I think, was, was for Gene to retrieve his reputation. And the idea that maybe Gene did some awful, terrible thing, um, I think that's laid to rest by the little evidence the city really put on. Richards claims the entire process was unfair. He says the mayor asked him to resign without fully understanding the allegations against him. The process that I wanted, I was able to have. It's one that I wasn't able to have with the mayor's system. So I'm very pleased that I had my time and I was able to uh, you know, get some answers to some questions. It shouldn't be that difficult. Gene Richards served BTV as airport director since 2012. Nick Longo has been acting as airport director since June. Reporting live tonight from the newsroom, Courtney Kramer, Local 22 News.